Hey everyone, pine needle tea has long been a favorite with the early settlers such as the Native Americans, both for its refreshment and for its medicine. If you didn't know, but pine needle tea contains five times the vitamin C, a freshly squeezed orange juice, and is high in vitamin A. It's also a decongestant and can be used as an antiseptic wash when cooled. So not only does it taste good, but it's good for you. Each pine does have its own unique flavor, so experiment and see which needles you like best. Just remember that while all pines are evergreens, not all evergreens are pines. So head out to the backyard or park where you can find it and positively identify your pine trees. Bring back some needles and give this one a try. The rest of the video, my wife gives a simple and quick summary how to identify the white pine, washing process, and making the tea. Enjoy. Today we'll do a white pine tea. Um, during the cold season, it's a fabulous tree to drink. Um, these are the branches that we found uh, in a local park. Uh, white um, pine identification is uh, five needles. So, one, two, oh, this one is broken. <laughs> okay, let's count. Uh, so it's one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so five needles. That's your identification of the white pine. White pine has um, like five times more uh, vitamin C than a lemon. It actually like a flavor much more than a lemon. Um, so what we usually do, I just grab a branch and um, I take the pine needles off. Okay, and I wash them in the water. Okay. And once they're washed, just uh, grind them off. So you wash it and yeah, do you soak water. it? No, no, no. Oh, just, just wash it. it. And just wash it, yeah, yes. and then I'll dry it. Yeah, rinse it. It's and okay. these can be found in anywhere? Like in the parts, yeah. yeah. The United, United States, States, Canada. It's uh, the white pine grows in uh, North America. Okay. Everywhere in North America. Okay. Okay, so I'll just take uh, only the needles. Okay. Now, uh, the tea you can drink like during the cold season. I usually drink like two cups a day without any problems, but I don't have any <laughs> known allergies. So if you are allergic to pine, then obviously that is not the tea for you. Otherwise, there is no uh, health problems. Okay, so now what we do is just uh, stuff it in a cup. Really, that's easy. I don't even cut. Some people like to cut it. I don't even like to cut it. I just put it inside the cup and pour hot water inside and simmer for 10 minutes. And drink, drink it just from a cup without even taking it out. Because needles are so big, so they don't bother me. Okay. If you want, you can always uh, add some honey to it. Okay. And um, I like using uh, a bright cups during the winter to brighten the day. <laughs> Thank you.